we are getting an inside look at one home of the future that has green tech all over. Oh, it sure does. ABC 70's reporter Lauren Martinez takes you to this innovative home in the South Bay with a pretty big price tag. This is it. Amazing. Pleasure meeting you. So nice meeting you. Thank you. Manmohan Mahal is giving us a tour of what he's calling the Tesla of homes. From the ground up, this house in Palo Alto was built to be sustainable and innovative. We can take the energy as we need it. And our objective is to make these homes as net zero. Mahal's company, Sidco, uses fire-resistant paneling that wraps around the house. It's made out of magnesium oxide. Steel frames are the bones of the home instead of lumber. Water from the showers and laundry machine gets collected into a tank and filtered outside. And we utilize this water for irrigating all the plants in our back area. Everything is run on electrical power. The home uses no gas. So Tesla roof tiles take all the energy from the roof and bring it out and store it into the power walls. So the power walls kind of store the energy, which can also run all the induction cooktop, heating and cooling, and electric car charging. The house is still hooked up to city power, but it's capable of being self-powered through the battery backup system for up to one week. Uh, coming from India, I always admire these open spaces. Uh, outside the homes, you know. Mahal was inspired to create a healthier world after undergoing a major operation 30 years ago. Since I received a heart transplant, I wanted to leave something good behind for the humanity, you know, and show them that the technology exists. We can build these homes today. The house is on the market for 3.7 million. Mahal and his daughter Simran hope it can be a model for a greener future. People are still valuing homes that are larger. So it's still, there's a, a big value in the consumption that's happening, and this home is really about conservation. If you'd like to see the house for yourself, it will be open this Saturday from 11 to 3. In Palo Alto, Lauren Martinez, ABC 7 News.